I'm going in. Here's Katsumoto. Gray Admiral coming up. Super echelon. Rolls Royce deal goes in. Here's Tanico. Goes straight in. Hard arch to the outside gate. Goes in. And away they go. Oh, losing the rider was Wise Curlin. Number two, Wise Curlin lost the rider at the start. Katsumoto showing good speed, trying to avoid that riderless horse out here. Grey Admiral is the grey going up to race second. Super Echelon in a tad tight. Hard Archers on the far side. Rolls Royce deal at the rail. Three lengths off these leaders. It's another three lengths back to Tad Nico. On to the back stretch they go now. And Katsumoto down at the rail. And Grey Admiral, they lead it by two lengths. Hard Arch has the white blinkers. Rolls Royce deal is down at the rail. Super Echelon between them. Only three and a half covers five. And still Tanico at the back. They run to the half mile pole. Katsumoto down at the rail. Grey Admiral's keeping the pressure on. They've set a decent pace up front. Rolls Royce deal is tucked in third alongside Super Echelon. Hard Arch is only three lengths off those leaders. Tanico going to pull to the outside to make his run. Past the three eights they go. Katsumoto at the rail and Grey Admiral. Grey Admiral gets the lead. Here's Hard Arch coming after them third. Tanico's making good ground now. Takes fourth and comes after the leaders. Then Rolls Royce deal. Top of the lane. Grey Admiral the leader's got to keep off Tanico though. Tanico continues to make good headway on the outside. Hard Arch in the white cap in behind that. Rolls Royce Deal gets a run at the rail and Rolls Royce Deal joins the fray. Homeward bound to Nico getting the lead. To Nico in front and pulling clear with a 16 to go. Rolls Royce Deal running on at the rail, but to Nico just too powerful today. To Nico and Santiago Gonzalez win it well. Rolls Royce Deal was second, then Grey Admiral and Hard Arch. The unofficial result with a number one, Tanico. Second number four, Rolls Royce deal. Third number seven, Grey Admiral. Fourth number nine, Hard Arch. Stewards are taking a look at that start where number two, Wise Curlin, lost the rider. Ladies and gentlemen, please note we do now have a steward's inquiry involving the unofficial winner number one, Tanico, and number nine, Hard Arch, into an incident at the top of the stretch. Please hold all tickets. Steward's inquiry involving one and nine into an incident at the top of the stretch.
Ladies and gentlemen, the stewards have ruled there will be no change to the original order of finish. It will remain one, four, seven, nine. Now in the compass winner's circle, number one, Tanico. He's a five-year-old bay gelding by Gio Ponti. Out of life happened. He's owned by Pick Six Racing. Winning trainer is Phil D'Amato, whose assistant is Linda Thrash. Winning rider, Santiago Gonzalez. The winner was winning Kentucky by Mac Hall. Gives the Mac Hall the second winner's breeders on the afternoon.